Hey everybody, I just want to say thank you for pressing play. I'm glad you're here. This is part two of my God Is series, and today I just want to share a little bit with you about how God is my hope for tomorrow. Um, last time I talked about how God is my provider, and uh, today it's a little gloomy outside, dark and gloomy, and this just reminds me um, of how it can be in our lives sometimes. Sometimes we just have dark and gloomy days. Um, and for me, sometimes I have days where I can't put a place on my emotions. I can't explain my emotions. Uh, there have been times when I've had troubles in my finances, in my relationships, in friendships, in, uh, or just relationships, period. And um, I can admit that there have been some times when um, there have been days when I've even just wanted to just give up and throw in the towel. But I thank God for this uh, key verse that he always brings to me when I do have those days. And that's Romans uh, chapter 5. And that's verses 3 through 5. And this is how it goes. It says, and not only that, but we also rejoice in our afflictions because we know that affliction produces endurance. Endurance produces proven character and proven character produces hope. This hope will not disappoint us because God's love has been poured out in our hearts through the Holy Spirit who was given to us. And whenever I'm having a dark and gloomy day like this, this is the scripture that pops up in my mind. So it's important for us to have life scriptures that we can just pull out in those days that we, where we need them. And this is a key scripture for me because um, in those days, I just know that because I love Jesus, because he's in my heart, because he, there's a joy that's on the deep, on, on the inside of me, I know that the hope that I have in him will not disappoint me. So I can really pull that out. So I just want to encourage you today that whatever you're facing, put your hope in Jesus and he won't ever disappoint you. I promise you, if you just give him a try, trust him with your heart, trust him with your circumstances, trust him with everything that you're going through. I promise he will come through on time every time. So for you, I pray that just as God is my hope for tomorrow, I pray that he is your hope for tomorrow and that you won't ever give up. Be encouraged today.